the church of the cemetery. What a blessing. I pitched my tent there last night, my kitchen, my dining table. It actually starts to, to drizzle a little bit. Now it started raining. Well, it doesn't stop raining. It's a light rain, but it's enough to, to bother me. It was not supposed to rain today. Because tomorrow and the day after tomorrow, there's going to be a lot of rain. And then it's very difficult to be on, uh, on the trails, because they're full of mud. Here is to fell a lot. Let's see, let's see. New day, new adventure on the Monsec by Packing Loop. It's really annoying. It stopped raining. It was almost sunny. I stop, I remove my jacket, my pants. Two minutes later, it starts raining again. I hate this weather. It's not raining a lot. But it's enough to get you wet in like 20 minutes, 30 minutes. So you have to wear some protection. I managed to climb into the cloud. I hate these days. You sweat, you're cold. You need to put the rain gear, you need to put the jacket. Take off the jacket, take off the rain gear. Put on the jacket. Wow. And I can't even see anything around. Maybe I start to see a little bit of landscape now. This route is really beautiful. It's a pity that last night, instead of taking videos, I took hyperlapses. Yesterday was a great day, very, very good. I have been climbing for the last uh, three kilometers. I think I still have to climb another five kilometers. Here, it didn't rain much. I think it's mostly rain where I was. The ride is really nice, but it is miserable. I had to stop again at the church because it was raining. And I stop. Now we are in the cloud. It's chilly. But the, the route is really nice, very, very nice. Although you can't see much around, but it's nice. of valley let's see if the weather is a bit nicer in this part of the world you look at the road. Yeah, the weather seems nicer here. It's worse on the other side. Darker. Very slippery rocks. I have to be careful not to fall. Oh, look at 
like this. Beautiful. Anche le caprette ci fanno ciao. Bucolic, very bucolic. And here it didn't rain. I came down there on the other side, climb back up and now we are going down. At the bottom of this uh, downhill, I will stop for lunch. Stop recording. stop here for lunch because I already feel the humidity of the of the water if I go down there I'll be cold lunch was satisfying now I'm next to the water reservoir the sun disappeared again looks like it wants to start raining again I don't know I'm gonna take a picture now. Nice turn up. It's pretty high. That's it. If you can see it. Impressive operation. That's the river. Water reservoir. River. I guess they, they put this because they don't want uh, suicidal people to have an easy job. No lights here. Okay, it's a bit dark. Ah, much better. Couldn't see anything. Yeah, that's the end of it. We must live there. Two big birds. I think they have the nest up there. I could hear them before I saw them. Now, four kilometers climbing. We need to climb this way. Although whoever traced the Monsac by packing route went up a little bit on that trail, it came down. I don't know why. And that trail also ended up where this uh, road goes. So I don't know why. To be honest, the last part would have been a bitch. Jesus. Let's keep on going. I'm on top, it's time to put on the jacket and descend. It's a short descent, but still, I don't want to get cold. It's two, three kilometers. It is chilly. Pretty chilly. Another big farm. You can smell them very far. I always wonder, with Spanish people consuming so much pork, 
Where are all the pigs? But now I can tell you, a lot are here in the Monsac. This guy, go. Very beautiful. Yet again, Monsac. Beautiful and chilly. Be nice if it stays dry tonight. Climbing up to this village was insane. I could have gone straight on the road, but at least I have water. If I have a chance to camp, I'll camp. Five or six. About 20, 15 minutes to sunset. Let's see if I'm lucky tonight again to find a roof. The problem is the, the village is at uh, 16, 15 kilometers. Let's keep on going. The day is not over yet. Even though we are past the sunset, it's getting chilly. I'm getting a bit cold. I have to wear my jacket. The sky is on fire though. There are lots of those little villages. They are 90% abandoned. Another of these ermita. Unfortunately, it's probably closed. And no, no porch. Check it out if it's open, but I doubt they leave a church open. Mosques are always open. Churches, nearly never. That's good. Church is not open. Look at the sky. Ermita. And there is this little house here. It's gonna be closed, but I wanna check. Fucking hell, it's open. It's perfect. A little bit of fire to dry up the place a bit, warm it up for the night. Third second of fire, it's meditative. Sunrise, the church, the little refugio. I'm gonna show you my home for the night. This is what I pitch my tent. The fireplace, my dining table, chairs, everything. Very, very, very good. <laughs> Wow. 
wonderful views, wonderful start even this morning. It was a great night there at the little hut. I thought to stay there another night, take a day off, because today there is a weather warning. It will start to rain a lot. There is a, a storm coming between uh, this afternoon and tomorrow morning. And also, I'm a bit concerned about my tendinitis. The drug I'm taking is very strong. It should have gone by now. But I still feel, uh, feel some pain. So, I'm wondering if I should have stayed there or not. But maybe later I'll find a place where I can crash for the rest of the afternoon. I didn't have enough water for uh, staying there two days, to be honest. Maybe I could have rationing a bit. I don't know. Let's see how miserable I'll be this afternoon and then I'll tell you if it was a good call or not. Well, let's enjoy the ride now, Mont Sec, by packing loop. Love it. Mountains, hills, farms. I'm glad I'm going down some of this here. Look at that chunk of rock. Massive, massive rock. Starting to get dark on that side. In 10 kilometers, I will arrive to a village and I will assess the situation. Check again the weather forecast. Check the weather warning. And then decide what to do.